Welcome to the second and last semi-final of the Guru Knockout Quiz. We're joined by Will Reynolds and Ben Hag, both of which were incredibly impressive on their qualifiers and like quarterfinals. I think it's going to be a close match this, boys. Yappe, you looking forward to it? Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Will, Will seems the strongest contender so far, so... Will was my early favourite. have to be on the ball. Mm, early favourite, Will. None of my... They won't line up for me today. I can feel it. <laughs> right. So you both. My pick at the start, hey? Yeah. But to be fair, yeah. Hag, you've I'll you've done video. you've done really well on every one of them, and I, uh, every time I come back and think, Hag could win this. Yeah, mm. steady Eddie. Yeah, it? steady. Yeah, but Mesa was on a different yeah. level in terms of uh, his first couple of rounds. Um, they were really good against Pem, so it's going to be a good close battle, I think, in the final. Whoever whoever gets through. Whatever it may be. Right, I uh, briefed you a little bit on the rule change. Everyone watching, slight rule change on the closest wins questions. The two gurus will put their um, answers up on a piece of paper. So I'm going to, uh, instead of having the closest wins, which the person answers, and then the second person goes after. So makes it a little bit fairer, a little bit more interesting. So are we ready? Ready to rock and roll? Yeah, uh, I think so. Ready to rock and roll. Lovely. Right, number one. What is the smallest size of Guru micro shot? Will I? Will's first. Me? Hey. Twelve. That's correct. Will, well done. Just a bit of a brief for everyone watching. If someone puts their hand up and gets it wrong and then the following person gets it right, they lose the point and automatically get a point. So it's a two-point shift. So, number two. I will have no moaning from you, Hag, as well, either. I've just had a little bit of a moan. I heard it. Yeah? You don't <laughs> want to be losing points. Now, yeah, semi-final stage. Big times, this. You don't want to be losing points. No, no. You need to get a T-shirt saying, respect the quiz master. Respect. Frankie says respect. Right, num <laughs> number two. Reportedly, what is there more of than humans in New Zealand? Go on, boy. Have a stab at that one. <clears throat> Not losing a point, me. Bit of general knowledge right, here. Points to lose, but... General knowledge. Right, I'll give you a clue, because I'm going to give you a little bit of clue to get some points on the board. You have to be quick. It's an animal. Hag? Hag? No, I'm not going to go for it. Go on, Hag. You've said it now. Go on, Hag. Go for it. No, because well, well, how's it? Will I get knocked back to minus one? If Will Will has to get it correct, right. yeah. I don't know, mate. I don't, <laughs> I don't want to. Um, I don't. I don't want to guess, do I? Right, that was very, um, very yellow-bellied of your hag. Um, right, number two. The answer to that question was sheep. Sheep. I've never would have said you that. You never would have I knew that hey, straight off the bat. Wrong. I was, I was going to say, say like say, lion or something like that. <laughs> oh, sheep. I was going to say a really silly question. I, I was going to say ants. Ants. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's thousands of them, isn't there? Yeah, there's, Millions a, of them. there's like over 30 million sheep in New Zealand and there are only 5 million humans. You need to get your general Jesus. knowledge up, boys. Come on. Mm. Wipe out. Number three. In total... How many children do Prince William and Harry have? Will. Hag. Will's first. Four. That's correct, Will. Good knowledge. <clears throat> need to be Frankie. quick. Need, need to be quicker, Hag. Come on. Me. I know. <laughs> Might give me right off yet again. No, no, you'll see. <laughs> Number four. What county... Is the famous Boddington Reservoir located? Very reserved quiz. This, come on. Again, mate. If it was normal, I'd have a go because I think I may know it, but I don't want to risk being like three points behind Will. I'll give you a clue, and you both got to be quick because you can't be moaning, right? It starts with the letter N. Hag. Hag. 
I don't want to say it. It's not mean, such it's in Northamptonshire. Northamptonshire. That is correct, Hag. Well done. That's what I was going to say, but I was well just done. Like, like that. <laughs> Don't be so scared, Hag. Go for it. Fortune <laughs> favours the brave. Number five. This is a recent news article. Right. I hope you've been keeping an eye on Facebook and stuff like that. Recent news, this. Right. GG Hadid. Hag. Fair play no, if you get it, Hag. Go for it. Finish the question and then I'll be first to answer it. I'm... I, can't, I, can't, I can't finish the question because it would be unfair on Will. Yeah, I've got to wait for it. Well, there's not, the trouble is now, oh yeah, I shouldn't have said, I, I know I know two things. It's going to be pregnant, pregnant with, with Zayn Malik. I will give you that because the yeah I'll give you that one hag. The reason why is, the question was <laughs> Gigi Hadid recently announced she is recently announced she is pregnant with which One Direction star and it's Zayn Malik. So I'll give you that one. Uh, right. Well done, hag. Right, boys. Old Zane ain't doing bad, is no, he's doing really well. Old Zane's done very well, hasn't he? Absolute cracker. He's from Bradford, which is not far from where I'm from. I'm not from Bradford. If anyone's watching. Uh, closest wins. This is a s number six, right? So I need your pen and paper. What I'm going to do is I'm going to give you five seconds to think about it. A little stopwatch. And then I'm going to... Oh, ten seconds. Now, nah, five seconds. That's all you're going to have. Right, and then three, two, one, you've both got to show it. Right, so the question is, what is the total number of points for the highest recorded Premier League season? Victory, like so, the winning team for the Premier League. What's the total number of points, the highest amount? Right, I'll give you five seconds. Mm. Right, boys, I'll count down from three, two, one. Show me your answers in three. Hag, hag, you, hag. Well, that, that worked quite well, to be fair. You both showed me. The answer to that question is 100 points. So, well done, Hag. You, you, you win that point. 100 points. That was... Um... You were 91, Will. That was close. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was going to say, I what? thought it'd be early 90s, but I didn't think it was 100. 100, yeah. Man... No, it's normally about 85, isn't it? Man, yeah. Man City yeah. in 2017 to 2018. Man City scored is that. that... Not, not, lose, not lose the game all season. Don't know. No, Don't know. I think Arsenal are the, are the only unbeatables, aren't they? Yeah, the only ones. Yeah. But even when they done that, they only had about. They had a lot of draws, didn't they? Points. Yeah, yeah, they had loads of draws. Right. Well done, Hag. <coughs> Three, two. So, well done. Well done. Number seven. Right, boys. Who holds the current world record as the fastest ever 100 metre sprinter? Will Hag. Will's there first. Usain Bolt. That is correct, Will. Well done. Frank has done me out of three questions big time here. <laughs> Hag, that is stop unbelievable. You so you so far behind. It's like Will, and then it's like Hag. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm gonna blame I'm gonna blame Griff Lag then. <laughs> Griff Lag. Right. Okay. We're on number eight. All square, 3-3. Three, three. How many different flavours slash colours are in the mainline match Captivate flavoured colourants? Hag. Hag. You're usually really good on these, Hag. How I many? Wanted, I know what I want to say, but I'm not 100% sure. You need the total amount of them. All the... Far, all the uh... Five. There's five. Good knowledge, Hag. There is five. Yeah, I would have, I would have said five, but I won't ask for that boy. Green, green, yellow, red, brown, and orange. Good knowledge, Hag. As usual, all them. To be fair, Hag's bang on the mainline match knowledge. He gets them right every time. Boy. Number nine, probably one of my favourite questions I've asked throughout the whole quiz. Oh, right. Ooh. I love, I love this program. Right. What was the famous catchphrase of Rex Hunt? I don't think to watch a lot of Rex Hunt. 
Oh, you've never watched Rex Hunt? Uh, right, I'm gonna, I'll am gonna. i give you a little cl clue. It's the same word twice. That's the only clue I'm going to give you. I'm still not sure. Should we have a uh, white? No, Should, we, on, Should we give it a miss? Yeah. Right, it's, it's yibbida yibbida. Yibbida yibbida. Yibbida yibbida. Yibbida yibbida, folks. It's yibbida yibbida so time. Rimmer would say. It's, oh, such a good programme. I used to love it. <laughs> Closest wins, number 10. How many bones does the human body have? Right, so I need you to write your answer down on your sheet of paper, and then I'll give you five seconds from now. Think about it, which is technically... How, right. many, how many bones does the human body have? How oh, many bones? Because we had that in a quiz the other night. How many bones are in the human body? Right, you just need to write an answer, and I'll count you down. Three, we had this two, two one, show me. The answer to that question was 213. So well done, Will. Good knowledge, mate. I swear that we had that. Well done, Will. Unlucky that, Hag, to be fair. I was quite a good guess, to be, to be fair to you. Uh, I didn't have a clue again, mate. It's really close, lads. Really close. Oh, it's tied. 4-4. Four, four. <laughs> This is another closest wins. Right, so I need your pen and paper again. Pen and paper. Oh, yeah, get the pen out. Number 11. What is the British record weight of a chub? British record weight of a chub? Yeah, I need it in pounds and ounces. Um, so, British record of a chub. Get me stopwatch out. And I'll count you down. Both got an answer? Yes. Yeah. Incredibly close guesses there, right? The answer to that question was nine pounds, so you both bang on. Nine pounds, five ounces. Well done, Will. <laughs> You're on it. That is close. unbelievably close. Very tight, very tight, boys. Number 12. From which animal does Italian pancetta come from? Hag. Hag. Is it a pig? Correct, Hag. Good knowledge, mate. Well done, Ben. Great knowledge, that. I'd have said New Zealand sheep. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, you two are probably the closest matched pair, apart from Dean and Pemtry on the last one. Incredibly close, this. I think you've, it's going to go down in the wire, I've got a feeling. Go down to the wire. Mm. Oh. It's, uh, it's quite hard for me as well, because the, the three that I've been a bit slow on, I've new as well, so... <laughs> <laughs> oh. 13. Geography question. What is the capital of Poland? Hag. Hag. Krakow. Incorrect, Hag. Big chance. Hey. Big chance for Will. Big chance. I'm going to say Warsaw. Or Warsaw, is it? Will, that is correct. Oof. And yeah. oh. Wow. Right. Warsaw, right, because... Krakow is the second largest city in Poland. Hey, you never said largest. You never said the biggest city. You said the capital. Yeah, but the capital is Warsaw, the largest city. That's yeah, a shit. Warsaw, that's up north, isn't it, near you? <laughs> Warsaw. Warsaw. Warsaw, near Halifax, isn't it? <laughs> near Halifax. It's <laughs> Birmingham. Near Birmingham. It's not even in Poland. <laughs> 14. Oh, well done, Will. Yes, you've had it now, haven't you? Still got a long way to go. Seven questions left, Hag. What colour is the elastic on the Guru light catapult? Hag. Will. Hag's first. 
orange. Good product knowledge, Hag. Well done. 15. In 2019, the Angling Trust Riverfest final was held in which town? Mm, oh, I think I know it. I don't want to risk losing. I know what I want to say. Yeah, I, I think I know what I want to say, but I don't want to risk losing this. Riverfest final was held in... I know it. I know it. I'm not... Should I give you both a clue? Yeah. It starts with the letter S. Oh. Oh. That changes Sorry, things. Well, that changes things. Exeter. S. <laughs> That's incorrect. Oh, I thought you said X. <laughs> Is it sh No. Shrub no. no, no hang, on, hang, hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Shh. Well, right, you've got that one. In, in, that one's incorrect, right? Well, that was unfair. I thought you said X. S. S Shrewsbury. I'll give. I don't want to get. I'll give Shrewsbury. I'm going to say it. Shrewsbury. That is correct, Hag. <sighs> right. What I'm going to do there. Back. What I'm going to do there. I'm only going to give Ben one point because I think you mi misheard the uh, the clue. So I'm going to give Ben one point. I'm not going to take a point away from Will. I think that's fair. What? Yeah. It's, I'm, I'm, still. I'm, the, I'm the quiz master. Well, final decision. Master. Yeah. Well uh, done, quiz is, is, is Shrewsbury in Shropshire? Because I was going to say Shropshire, but you said town. Yeah, Shropshire it is. Oh, uh, because I was going Shrop, Shrop, and I was thinking, oh, I mm. knew it was Shropshire, but then I didn't. I thought you probably said town, didn't you? Yeah, it were on the River Seven in Shrewsbury. It has been for the last two or three years, I think. Shrewsbury, that's one, the one. One by Ian Ward in the 2019 one. So, 16. I feel like that were a very fair decision by me. I feel like I've grown a lot as a quiz master. You did. Yeah, well done, Frank. Yeah, I'll get you a little, um, I'll get you a little crown from Burger King. A little king crown. <laughs> I don't know if I was weird by then. No, none of us do. 16. Very close now, lads. Who did Wales appoint as their football manager in 2018? Hag. Will. Hag. Oh. Ryan Giggs. Good knowledge, Hag. It's correct. It certainly is. I was going to say Chris Coleman at first, but that's who they got rid of. 2017, it? he left, yeah. Chris Coleman, is that the ex, uh, ex Fulham? Fulham. Yeah. Fulham manager, yeah. 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 No, I'm not. Well, I'm not really very good at football because I don't really like football, but... Done well there. It's, it's just sport, isn't it? I just know, know a bit about sport. Easy. Number, number 17. Got four questions left. Google Chrome, Firefox Chrome. and Safari are all types of what? Will. Will. Web browser. That is correct, Will. Good knowledge, mate. Well, really, Will. really good quiz, this, boys. Not going to lie. Closest one yet. You've got one, two questions wrong as well. That's brilliant. <laughs> Usually got like five wrong by now. I need your pen and paper for number 18, boys. This is a multiple choice question, so both of you could get this right. What, what do you mean, all right? Yeah, so you've got A, B, or C to choose from. Both of you get the point. Just write A, B, or C, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Number 18 is which of these three movies is the worldwide highest grossing box office film of all time? Hang on, say that again, mate. You're all cracking up the highest grossing. Okay. Okay, yeah, basically. Which of these three movies is the worldwide highest grossing box office film of all time? Basically, I mean, which one has made the most money? It's so, has made the most money. Yeah, yeah. All right, got ya. A. Box office. A is Avengers Endgame. Avengers. B is Avatar. Or C is Titanic. So I'm going to give you five seconds. Then I'm going to need your answer. I'll count you down, though. Don't, you don't need your answers yet. 
Right. So three, two, one. Show me. The answer to that question is A, Avengers Endgame. Well done, Will. Up the Marvel. Well done, Will. Very, very good knowledge. Up the Marvel. Absolutely love Marvel films. What a, what a film. Brilliant. So I've never watched that. The, the only film I've ever watched out of all three of them was Titanic. <laughs> hey. What, what is, uh, what you, is you the first one? What? You need what to go and have a serious chat with yourself now. You've got to watch all the Marvel films of now. The brilliant, mate. Avengers, no, Avengers, don't, Avengers don't, Endgame. Uh, don't, don't find that. Nah, it's not for me, that. Not float your boat? Like fantasy, isn't it? Not into it. Do you like what I did there, float your boat, Titanic? That one of the questions. Float your boat, Titanic. Yeah. The tank. Did I lose a, did I lose a uh, point then? No, you didn't yeah, lose probably. a point. You just Will just gets a point. All right. Number 19. The Guru... Micro hair stops come in which three colours? Will. Will's there. Brown, red and yellow. Correct that, Will, mate. Well done. Oh, Will's won it. Well done, Will. Really good knowledge, that, mate. This is a closest win. This is the closest wins again. Think, mate. Right, this is the closest wins again. It's very close, Hag. So this is, I need your pen and paper. Number 20, the final question to the semi-final. Is what is the biggest ever recorded great white shark caught on a rod and reel? I need the answer in pounds. So this is not going to be a multiple choice. This is, I need your guess. That was a... Um... I need, no, I need you to write it down, Will. Write it down on your pen and paper. What? I need your answer. On a rod and reel? On a rod and reel, what is the largest ever recorded great white shark caught? Give you five seconds. Okay, boys. Right, three, two, one. Show me. Will? The answer to that question is three thousand four hundred twenty-seven pounds. So well done, Will. Well done, Will. Really I'll good. Tell you what, I am losing. <laughs> Let me have a count up. Let me have a count up first. The final scores is ten seven. On the doors. Is ten seven. Well done, Will. To Will Reynolds, you are the. Finalist to the Guru Knockout Quiz. Well done, mate. Well done. Hag, give him a clap. Hag, come on. Hag. Well done, Will. Well done, Will. Really tight, that, boys. Really tight. Well done. That was good knowledge, that. It's all losing me. I'm going to smash up the house now. Hey, you did. Hag, you've done really well in every one of the qualifiers. You did really well, mate. Give you something to do in the next few weeks. Put it back together again. Yeah, yeah, good point. Though. Hey, both of you, incredibly, incredibly, like, matched in terms of, like, knowledge. I think you've both done really well throughout the whole thing. No, I think I, th I think Will's definitely been the uh, de Will's been the strongest. Like, he's going to win it. Will, I'm... 100% uh, stronger uh, than Macy. Hey, Macy's... Macy, uh, never right off Macy. He's, he's won two of them tiebreakers. He's always... He's, he's, like, in there all the time. He's there. Mm. Yeah, I don't know. Under pressure when it matters, he's the one, isn't he, Macy? He, he can hold his Never bottle. Crumbles. Never crumbles. Athlete, Olympic athlete. But yeah. that's it, boys. Thank you very much for playing. Ben, honestly, Cheers, mate, you, you've, you've done really well. Uh, Hello, well done, really Will. well. Will, mate, well done, ben. I'll, see you in the, I'll see you in the next couple Ta of days, Will, and uh, hopefully the final uh, will be a good one. Hag's gone. Thank you. <laughs> he's, got <laughs> he's got Munk on. <laughs>